in your patience, possess ye your souls, and when ye shall see Jerusalem compassed with armies, then know that the desolation thereof is nigh. Overnight, missiles streaked above the sky in northern Israel. Hezbollah said it launched hundreds of rockets and drones from Lebanon, but Israel said it had thwarted a much larger planned attack. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. The views on this channel are those of Omega Watchman Media Group LLC, and not those of Google, YouTube, or their advertising affiliates. Due to the mature nature of this content, language, and death, viewer discretion is strongly advised. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What up? In the last few hours, Israel and Hezbollah have exchanged fire, with fears growing of all-out war in the Middle East. Hezbollah says its strikes are in retaliation for the killing of a top military commander last this month. This is an Omega Watchman Media Group production. This know also that in the last days, perilous times shall come, and he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass. But the end is not yet. All these are the beginning of sorrows. Fire after Israel launched what it called preemptive strikes on targets in southern Lebanon. Hezbollah says its attack is the first phase of retaliation for the killing of its commander, Fouad Shukur, in Beirut last month. Israel briefly suspended all flights in and out of Ben Gurion International Airport in Tel Aviv, and an emergency situation was declared by the Israeli Defence Minister. The escalation coming as Gaza ceasefire negotiations take place in Cairo. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Over the Lebanon Israel border, the sky peppered whoa. with Hezbollah's Katusha rocket fire and drones. At around 5 a.m. local time, the IDF announced it had launched a preemptive strike on Hezbollah targets, preparing to launch on Tel Aviv from inside southern. This Lebanon. is an Omega Watchman Media Group. But production. Jerusalem shall be safely inhabited, and this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem. Their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet and their eyes shall consume away in their holes, and their tongue shall consume away in their mouth.
Israel launched a wave of airstrikes into southern Lebanon Sunday morning in what the government said was a preemptive strike against a Hezbollah attack. The Iran-backed militant group said it successfully launched hundreds of rockets and drones toward Israel. Bradley Blackburn has more on the conflict, which is fueling concerns about a wider war. Overnight, missiles streaked above the sky in northern Israel. Hezbollah said it launched hundreds of rockets and drones from Lebanon. But Israel said it had thwarted a much larger planned attack. The IDF is striking terror targets in Lebanon from which Hezbollah was planning to launch their attacks on Israeli civilians. The Israeli military said its operation involved approximately 100 fighter jets that destroyed thousands of Hezbollah rocket launchers located in more than 40 launch areas in southern Lebanon. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu met with officials at the Defense Ministry during the operation. Whoever hurts us, we hurt him, Netanyahu said. Officials briefly closed Israel's main airport, diverting planes to safer locations. Travelers were rattled by flight delays due to the threat of rockets. We hear that there's drones, missiles, rockets. You see everyone's faces, everyone's scared. The U.S. recently deployed more military assets to the region amid concerns of wider war between Israel and Iran. Hezbollah's ongoing aggression risks dragging the people of Lebanon, the people of Israel, and the whole region into a wider escalation. The fresh conflict could disrupt ongoing ceasefire talks for Israel's war with Hamas. A new round of high-level talks is being held in Egypt Sunday. 